Hi everybody, usually I'm teaching lessons on my channel, but there's so much more to the guitar world than that, so I'm going to start expanding in many different directions. Anything I have learned that maybe I had to learn the hard way, I'm happy to teach you, so you might learn it slightly easier. So a little bit of gear review, there's certain pieces of gear that I adore, and I thought why not talk about them, I've used them so much. So. The Line 6 Relay G10 Wireless System. I absolutely love using a wireless. All my concerts I use a wireless and even here at home when I practice, I'm so used to being wireless. I practice with a wireless system so I can walk around the house, go to the kitchen, go outside and still be playing guitar. So if there was one piece of gear I couldn't live without, it is a wireless system. And the one that I use is this one, the Line 6 Relay G10. It's not perfect, but it's bloody good. I give it roughly a seven out of 10 rating. I'll quickly tell you the only things that are wrong with it. Actually, I'll do that later. Firstly, I'll tell you the things that are right with it. It's a small unit, comes in a small box. The unit itself, the receiver, is also the charger. So right now you can see the green light flashing. So my unit here is charging, my transmitter. You just unplug that, and that right there is all that you need to plug into your guitar to go wireless. So plug it in here. And we have simply a cable running from the wireless receiver into the amplifier. And we're wireless, so we're on. So, got my guitar here. Tone is essentially flawless. I really haven't noticed any loss of tone at all. There's an old thing that Eddie Van Halen would play his concerts with a wireless system, but when it came to time to do his solo, he would use a lead to preserve the tone. Maybe gear has come a long way since that time. I don't notice any loss of tone. Few drawbacks. One of the major drawbacks is also the major benefit, ironically, because the device is so damn simple that what happens is that this unit here, the transmitter, connects to the receiver automatically. There's no dials or switches or knobs on the whole machine. Whereas with a more traditional wireless unit, you would connect to the frequencies that's a bit more work and a bit more tech and usually the devices are bigger and also requires a kind of battery pack which is typically worn on the guitar strap another reason i love this thing is because i don't use a guitar strap when i perform live here at home i'm playing the electric guitar so i am so it automatically connects becomes a serious issue not just an issue but this becomes a serious issue if there's other wireless gear on stage because or in your rehearsal room or wherever you're playing you run the risk when you're using this system I could connect my guitar to here. And for example, let's say another member of your band is using another one of these wireless systems plugged into a separate amplifier. If you go over to their side of the stage or the room, there is a chance, and it does happen, that your connection, rather than going wirelessly between your unit, your two units, it's actually gonna to go to the other person's unit. That can be annoying at best and gig destroying at worst. You can get uncontrollable, awful feedback. Sometimes at festivals, for example, the announcer would have a wireless microphone on the same stage that Calidad was playing, and I'd be getting feedback. And the reason I'm getting feedback is because my unit is transmitting into their unit. So you have to be really careful about that, and that is a major drawback, but it's also a major benefit because of the beautiful simplicity of just kind of plug and play. So the way that we get around this in Calidad, it's kind of unfortunate, but it works for us, is that my bandmate Tom doesn't use a wireless system. So typically this is the only wireless on the stage when we play, but I still have to be careful that other bands haven't left anything on or a festival hasn't got wireless gear. So that's a big drawback. The other big drawback, this is the second one of these that I've owned. And you can see here, I've actually had to have a technician use some kind of magic putty or sealant or whatever it was to actually reinforce the power connection into the unit. So the power connection's a bit crappy and I really wish they'd improve it because it's the only thing wrong with this bloody thing. So if I unplug it from the wall here, if I unplug it from the wall, you can see that's just like a USB cable like you would charge your Android phone with, just going into that unit there. Potential to be pulled out on stage. And then this thing on my first unit actually broke. So it actually kind of a piece kind of fell inside the unit itself. I was annoyed and I hadn't owned it for that long, probably less than a year. Admittedly, that's a year of hard touring but you don't want your gear to be breaking. And the only reason I replaced it or I chose to replace it despite those significant flaws is because it's a bloody good wireless. It works so nicely. It's easy, elegant and efficient. Good tone, good feel. I love this because then I can play the Spanish guitar. Like if I grab my Spanish guitar for a sec. 
I usually play concerts like this, so just with a Spanish guitar with these sort of things sticking out the side. I used to use, I used to use uh, line six, maybe it was the G50 or something like that, I can't remember what it was, but we used to actually use, tape them to the guitars rather than attach them to a strap. So I used to tape here and then have some ugly gaffer tape here. Now that worked and that worked reasonably well, but this is an improved solution. So I give it, let's say seven out of 10. It's basically perfect except for the serious drawbacks that the power construction is crap, line six, it's crap. And there's that significant risk of crossing over to another wireless channel because it automatically connects to the nearest wireless channel. Other than that, perfect, highly recommended, and I use it every night and I can't live without it. Thank you for watching.